speak and, and to, to say so. Uh, so thank you for your testimony. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, Andrea Flinders in opposition. Bob, use your time. How does he use my time that I'm a different oh. committee member than he is? Oh my God. Wow. Now, this ain't right. This is this is this ain't right. <laughs> it's a clown joke. This ain't right. Use my time. Okay. <laughs> Hi, I'm Andrea Flinders, I'm president of the Kansas City Federation of Teachers and School Related Personnel. And our organization wants to go on record in opposition of this bill. I mean, vehemently disagree that this bill is about transparency and accountability. Um, I believe that what this bill is really a, a, a designed to do is to silence the voices of our workers, to make things so cumbersome for unions, whether we're talking about um, the guidelines, the timelines, the fees, and eventually it will be virtually impossible for many of our, especially small local sixes, but for unions in general to spend all their time on paperwork instead of representing members. I think it's important um, to understand that, you know, what unions do is they provide balance, and they provide balance with management. Um, management doesn't always know what's going on in the work site because they're not the ones doing the work. You know, they're not the teachers. They're not working with the students in our classroom. Um, and I think it's important to understand that we work very closely with our district, with our school board, and with the administration um, to make sure that our kids and, and the communities they live in, that they have the best resources possible. What this bill would do, would this 